Hi everyone, I'm Rincy and this is Rincy Reads. For those of you who saw my video last Tuesday, um, you saw that I had recently hit 250 subscribers, so I'm doing a little Q&A session. Now, today is not the Q&A session as you can probably tell from the title of this video, but I decided to do a video on one of the questions asked of me because it's a question that I wanted to answer anyways in its own video, so I decided I would just do it right away since someone asked. Basically, this video is all about my favorite booktubers. Now, obviously there are the really popular booktubers like The Readables or Books and Squirrels, and I had already mentioned E. Lizzie Books in my last video, so I'm not including her or any of those really popular booktubers. What I decided to do is just highlight some people who may not be quite as well known within the booktuber community. Um, they probably have around the same number of subscribers um, that I do right now. There are also people that I really enjoy watching their videos. I watch all of their videos and I'll comment on most of their videos, if not all. And just so everyone knows, this list is just in alphabetical order by usernames. I mean, I didn't really want to rank people because it's not like I have a most favorite booktuber or anything like that. So I just put everyone's names in alphabetical order to keep it simple. The first booktuber that I wanted to highlight is Charlie Reads. She is someone who I really enjoy watching her videos and she just hit 500 subscribers so this is a great time for you guys to check her out if you don't already know her because she's doing a video every day this week to celebrate. She has a lot of fun in her videos. She has no problem giving her opinion whether she liked a book or not and she always picks up really interesting things in books that I don't necessarily see when I'm reading which is really good to just see another perspective and to pick up on other things through other people's videos. She seems like she would be just a really cool person to hang out with too. I mean, she has a black flag tattoo on her wrist, that's pretty cool. And she doesn't always do just booktube reading videos. She has videos on a couple other things, especially when people are asking her questions. She'll make a video on it, which is really interesting. So if you want something a little bit more than just books, she's a great person to check out. The next booktuber is Char and the Bookshelf. I think she is absolutely hilarious. She's supposed to be on a book buying ban and yet I feel like every video she's posted lately has been a book call. She does a variety of books. She'll do the young adult novels and she'll also do some adult novels and she'll do a variety of genres and she has just a million books on her bookshelf and she might have what I is the largest Stephen King selection I've ever seen outside of a bookstore or a library. Honestly, I think her videos are just a lot of fun to watch and she just seem, has so much energy and so much personality that I love watching her videos. Next up, the booktuber that I wanted to highlight is Emily the Odd One. She hasn't been doing booktubing for too long. I think she started around the same time that I did and I always liked her reviews. She's doing a 25 book challenge this summer before she goes off to college and she has a wide variety of books that she's already read and she's going to be reading throughout the summer. She has read books like Emma and Sense and Sensibility and The Ender's Game and just a whole variety of stuff that is really interesting and I always like her take on books. She is trying to be a writer as well so she definitely has an interesting take on all of that stuff. Next up is Hey 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 Books. I actually think she was one of the first people that has subscribed to my channel and the, one of the first people that I subscribed to uh, when I first started booktubing and honestly I think we have a lot in common in terms of the books we like and the things we like. I mean even just doing her bookshelf tour a lot of the DVD she had on her shelf I also have on my shelf which is just really funny. She loves Harry Potter and she just did a video all about Harry Potter which is really interesting and I thought it was really interesting seeing her talk about being sorted into Pottermore and things like that. She reads a lot of adult books and a lot of young adult books as well which is again a trend I guess. I, what I'm showing here I like people who do more than just young adult which is sometimes hard to find here in the booktuber community so if you're looking for someone with a little bit more variety definitely check her out. And the final user I wanted to highlight is the book fox. She is another booktuber that I think is just really funny and I don't think she realizes how funny she is. I always enjoy her videos and she recently made a video about her book reading quirks and I thought it was just so funny the different things that she does like how she keeps her stickers on her books even though most people hate having stickers or anything on their books but she has to keep them on there like she feels like they're part of the book and even just seeing her to be red pile makes me feel a little bit better about my to be red pile. 
So yeah, those are five of my favorite booktubers, so go ahead and check them out. I'll have links to all of their channels down in my description, and you guys can watch their videos and hopefully subscribe to them as well. They definitely deserve all the subscribers they can get. I hope everyone here in the U.S. has a great Independence Day, and I hope everyone who's in Canada had a great Canada Day. I'm a little late on that, but that's okay. As usual, I'll have links down in the description below to my Tumblr, Twitter, and Goodreads so you guys can follow me on there as well. So yeah, I hope everyone has a great holiday and thanks for watching. But uh, one of the questions, <clears throat> but one of the questions that was asked of me, uh, my favorite booktubers here on <sighs> people who are slightly slimmer, slimmer, and this list is not in any particular order. Actually, that's not true. She does a variety of books, you know, she does young A, but young A. And thanks for watching. Oh, I'm playing with my hands and camera. So yeah, oh, wait.